Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. If you already subscribe, thanks for it. In this video, we are going to learn how we can fetch over tutes from tutor by using Python programming language. So many times we require to make a small project in our school and colleges and we show the API fetching program by using Python. So here I have a small program. In this program I am using the Twippy. Twippy is a library that used to fetch the tutes from the tutor. It's a very simple. I will explain you each and everything. Just we have a few line of code and you see if I run this code, I have a latest tute from the tutor on my account. You see some account from my account, it's fetching a tutes and you see 19 tutes are coming. So once again, if I will run, then I will get the more fresh tutes. So it depends on the my home timeline. So you see these tweets are coming so what is the requirement for this just you have to write here the consumer key consumer secret key access token and access token secret key and from where we will get this i will explain you also just then we use the tube tupi library and in the o auth handler we pass consumer key and consumer secret key and we get the authentication here from this authentication we get the authentication of the project then access token and access token secret this one and we have the oath means authentication problem authentication uh, process we complete by these two steps now we pass this authentication object in a twp.api so by this api function they validate the information which is giving here and remember these information will be from your account not from mine so you have to do some process i will explain you what is the process then we have a api like this object and from this api i am fetching a home underscore timelines means the tute coming on tutors from my timeline so all the tute will come here and i create a count variable one by one i will execute on the basis of tutes and I'm, I'm reading a one tute from this tute and one by one I am displaying this tute here you see tute dot text so it is explain it is displaying here tute one and then the tute then line break then tute two like this we can display these tutes and our program will run and we are fetching once again you say new tutes coming this is a new tute this is coming here so like this we have the tutes from the timeline of the tutor so how we will get this and how we will install this tup library because you have to install it so for installing a tup library just go to the anaconda sites and we have this library conda install c junction suite just copy this and open the anaconda command prompt how where you can open this just search here anaconda like this and we have an anaconda command prompt open it and paste it and just press enter i have already installed so it would not install any library in my system because i have already installed so it will check and already my information is complete so you can install this on your system first before running this program So you see everything is done and it fetching the information already installed because I have installed already so no need to install again but it, it will install from your system if you will install it. So after this just close it no need this now now we have to open a tutor developer account you see developer.tutor.com remember that you have to open this then you have to go to your <coughs> project and there 
you will have your project and remember that first time you will open so you do not have any project i have single project name is fetch tutor msg but whenever you will open this you will have a blank dashboard and you have to search this add app button and you have to click on this button and after clicking this you have to fill some information like your name your address your mobile number your mail your personal information plus why you want to use this api for you are from the government agency or you are just using for your own project and so each and everything you have to fill and that is a process of half an hour process just click on this and complete the information i can't show you here because it's a personal information my personal also and it will be your personal also so do not show your information what you feel feel here but just click on here and complete the instructions after completing instruction you will have your project like this i have a single project you will have your name of project on if i click on this and i will have a more project also listed here so whenever you complete the process of project <clears throat> remember that if your process is complete your project is coming here then what you have to do you have to click on this setting if you want to change any setting you can go there and you can edit your information whatever you want to edit okay but i am not going to edit here anything just i want to show you that if you have this process now we need a key so just click on this key here on button and click on this and here we have the all keys so here i have generated so if you want to generate the key so click here regenerate the key and yes i want to regenerate and you see the key is coming key and secret key so it's coming once again so my older key will delete now so i have to copy this and i have to replace this key with my new one so here i will replace the key like this and then secret key like this then i have to replace this secret also because i am regenerating these key and then it is done i save it once again i need this access token secret key click on this and regenerate once again and i have a access key also just copy this i copy this and access key and replace this key with this and copy this one also and replace this key like this so key is generated replaced and i click on run and you will see that my token my tweets are also coming once again and if you do wrong thing means this key if this information is wrong and you do not have a access so kindly check your developer account and complete all the information which is required then your authentication process will be finalized and you will have this information so click on project once again you have a project click on this key and token and generate your key for this application as i explain you so after completing all these things and after getting these key and you just run your program and you will have the tweets from the tutor account and remember it is your account you can't you can't fetch the tweets from other uh, other accounts you will get your own account those are public to other also so that is for this <coughs> so i think you learn something from this video if you really learn please like and subscribe my channel and thank you for watching this video